Okay, so five great side hustles you can start right now with zero dollars in your pockets. Let's do this. Facebook Marketplace dropshipping. You've probably heard a lot about dropshipping. It's been a real plague of all finance center channels for a few years now, but not without a reason. The business model of such endeavors is extremely lucrative and profitable, and the success depends solely on the chosen products. But let's repeat real quick. Dropshipping is when you find a cool product for cheap, advertise it and sell at a higher price. When people buy the item from you, their order is automatically transferred to the original manufacturer, while you just sit there and relax, counting those bills you got from the price difference. But the standard model everyone recommends is too costly for beginners, you need to pay Shopify for the website, you need to pay for ads and so on. That's not really a zero dollar hustle. What I'm suggesting is different. Instead of paying for the website and advertisement, we'll just use Facebook Marketplace and groups. The basic algorithm is the same. You go on, for example, AliExpress and find a cool device or product that's USA manufactured. I suggest picking something you can also take advantage of so the money invested would be put to a good use anyways. Next, you just go on Facebook Marketplace and create a listing. To improve results, you can shoot a few videos of yourself and that product in use and upload those videos to Facebook groups with a link to your listing. And this way, you won't be spending a dime on advertising. I think this is a great workaround for beginners with no budget. After you sell the item a few times, you will have enough budget to create a conventional dropshipping site, but Facebook Marketplace will still be a very viable option. Creating mobile tutorial videos. Websites they don't want you to know, secrets of Photoshop, secret features of an iPhone. We've all seen these videos, shot on the phone with really simple editing, showing off cool little things in a tutorial-like format. I know you don't take it seriously right now, but such videos can become a great source of revenue. Shooting them is extremely easy, editing even easier, and the camera, you already have your phone. How to make money? Affiliate links. Let's say you're showing people secret tricks of Canva. You can actually go and generate yourself a referral link that will give people bonuses upon signing up. Then shoot the tutorial and place the link in the description of it. You can upload the video to YouTube, TikTok, Instagram, doesn't matter. As long as you can insert the affiliate link, you are golden. Such links can generate thousands of dollars, especially if the product you're linking to solves people's problems. You can shoot a mobile tutorial of using a gadget and then put an affiliate link to purchase that item on Amazon. You will make a percentage of every sale that happens as a result of clicks on your link. You can also promote courses or services through tutorials, for example, online courses or ordering digital services. You show opening a website, clicking through it, and making all the necessary actions. Then you leave a link to, for example, Skillshare, Udemy, or Fiverr. The affiliate commission is a very, very good source of revenue, especially if you can manage to create content for some time until you accumulate the momentum. All right, YouTube. You might believe that it's too late to start and succeed on YouTube. This could not be further from the truth, as the site offers fresh options on a daily basis. You never know when your video will go viral and your channel will gain popularity. It's probably one of the best site hustles out there, free to join, extremely lucrative and diverse. YouTube is a great place to earn money. Making money on YouTube isn't as difficult as you might think. You just need to reach 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 watch time hours. To put it into perspective, that's two or three really good videos. But you may say now, Arthur, I'm scared of cameras. To which I'll respond, there is a way for you. You don't need to show your face in order to grow a successful channel on YouTube. Some of the highest paid channels on YouTube are faceless channels, meaning the creator will never show their face. Chris Invest, Online Hustle, Brightside, Mustard, Found and Explained, Fail Army, the list can go on forever. How to make money on YouTube without showing your face? You use your voice, videos, pictures, Anything goes. If you want, you can start a musical stream or shoot videos of uh, ambient walks in the park or anything else. The beauty of YouTube is the fact that everyone can find his niche. You can do whatever you like and people will watch that. How about unclogging drains on roads? Boom, thousands of views. Maybe fixing carpets, millions of views. Garage sales, 
thousands of views again. On YouTube, you can make money even out of the most boring jobs ever. Are you a truck driver? Start an atmospheric vlog, show how you live and drive. Are you a fan of books? Start reading books under the lamp with a cup of tea. Do you love ships? Tell the world about ship design, world's biggest ships, and so on. The variety of options is endless, plus YouTube can generate money not only from AdSense. There are a plethora of opportunities and revenue sources available on YouTube. You can make integrations, use affiliate marketing, and a bunch of other methods. The best part is that you get to discuss your interests, whatever they are, gaming, photography, art, woodworking, fishing, or anything else. You have the chance to make a positive difference in someone else's life and earn a good deal of money out of it. So it's a win-win situation. Drone photography. Recently, I thought of an idea. People love their houses. All those home sweet home rugs at the entrance and weird ceramic gnomes on the grass. Many people in America love their houses and are proud of them. And you can earn money from that. To do it, you need a drone. And stop, don't close the video just yet. That can be a zero dollar business, really. Everyone has a friend or a relative with a drone. You can ask them to lend it for a day or two and try this hustle yourself. So here is the strategy. You go with a drone door to door on weekends, asking people whether they want a framed picture of their house from the bird's view. I guarantee if you visit 100 homes a day, at least five to 10 people will agree. Then you launch the drone, find the right angle, take a shot, and then head straight to the printing salon. There, you can print a good photo for a few cents, and in a $1 store, you can easily buy a frame for it. On Amazon, such frames that you need cost eight bucks or so. Then you just frame the photo and sell it to the happy house owner. You can ask all the way from 30 to $100 for it, so if you do just five houses in one day, that will give you a couple hundred extra dollars. Spend two days and you can buy yourself a drone. That's the fastest and easiest way into drone photography. And after you get your drone, the possibilities are endless. For example, you can shift towards real estate photography for real estate companies. Real estate photography is the photography of properties that are up for sale or rent. The goal of real estate photography is to create content for advertising material, making use of the drone's unique perspective. Companies need the most comprehensive presentation of their listings, so flying a drone around the property can become a great side hustle. If real estate is not for you, you can do events or weddings. The range of possibilities is almost endless. As for the earnings, for real estate photography, most drone photographers charge anywhere from $50 to $400 per project. This fee typically includes a brief flyover of the property and a quick 30 second to one minute video where you can grab plenty of still images. So not bad for an hour of work. As for the aforementioned weddings, many basic drone photographers often start at $500 for a simple overview flight with no editing. For longer videos with cinematic editing, many professional drone photographers charge upwards of $1,000 to $5,000 for 4K edited videos. It all depends on your skill, but you can definitely make a lot of money with drones. Google Ads Specialist. We all use Google, right? Do you know those small ads that appear in every search? Yeah, that's what I'm gonna suggest you to do. Google Ads are for sure the biggest ad player on the market right now, so every company will pay top dollar to make their ads appear on the page. And people who do are called Google Ads Specialists. Google AdWords Specialist is someone who knows how to set up Google Ads campaign effectively. Such a specialist is a person who can translate the basic needs of a business from its business language to the language of Google Ads campaigns. If you think that's another boring office job that doesn't pay well, you're wrong. If you open Upwork and search Google Ads and you'll see people making 25, 75 or even 200 bucks per hour with over $400,000 earned. But that must require an education in the marketing field, right? Wrong again. Google actually will teach you for free. Go to skillshop.withgoogle.com, scroll down to Google Ads and start learning. You will learn the ins and outs of how the platform works and how to create successful campaigns. Then you can apply your knowledge to provide the best results for your clients. Furthermore, with all the resources available, becoming a Google Ads expert is easier than 
ever. Begin with a course, then get certified and begin gaining experience. You will eventually become a legitimate Google Ads expert and be able to reap all of the benefits that come with it. And you can start these zero dollar hustles anytime and if you do everything right, you will see the results almost instantly, I would say. And smash that like button if this video was helpful to you. Subscribe to the channel so you won't miss new helpful videos. Thank you for watching and see you guys in the next one.